Hey guys, here I, I put in a, well it's a makeshift funnel set until the ice is better. But this is a, probably the only set I make where I will break the beaver dam and I don't do it till after two years till the, they don't fix it. But, and this is set up for a 220, but I don't have one so I've got a 330 in there for now at the end. You see, you put your fence along both sides, narrowing down to the point of where a 220 fits in there perfectly on a pole. And when the ice is thicker, I will continue this out about another three feet. And then at the ends, I will flare out into a Y again, you know, to make a bigger entrance for the otters to try and swim through. Um, the most important thing about this set is you have to have enough water flow to keep this here open so the otters just won't come there um, and there's not a lot of places on my line where i uh, have water flow like that although this year because of all the rain every pond i have pretty much has water flow but it will slow down and so if you're not on a, a actual creek system um, then what will happen is it will eventually just freeze solid if you don't have the constant water flow and then you're, you're just the set's waste. But like I said, I'll keep this thing going and even if I have to chop it out some more after, make it, you know, as long as you've got a few inches of water going over, the otter will make their way in there. And uh, like I said, so you've got the 330 set at the end. Whereas in the normal set, you would have a 220 and it would be set right in the middle here. And then as the water ice got thicker, you would just move it back farther and farther and farther to keep it into a, you know, deep enough water. Um, this is a deadly set if you've got otters traveling your area. Like now I'm probably not gonna catch an otter in this thing this year, just because there ain't enough otters around here. But you never know, I have seen them on this creek system here before. So, they may surprise me and one may come by, but usually I'll get these, any otters around here at Fish Lake, which is, you know, about a mile and a half that way. That seems to be in their starting point. And uh, they'll uh, move up this way. So, if I, that's why I see them here usually early in the fall. And, uh, and then once I get them out of Fish Lake, then they, they kind of stop coming out here. So they, they stop because there's none left. Alrighty. So, like I said, normally this would be continued out another few feet. It doesn't. It doesn't. It's, it doesn't matter how far out you put it. It's just. You got to make sure you get it into deep enough water so that this set's going to stay active for you know, a month at least to make it worthwhile. All right, so there's your funnel set. Okay, guys, here's the uh, funnel set for otter. Like this is a, another right after freeze up set. So, what you're doing is you're breaking the dam. And then you put a line of sticks like that and like this. Just wide enough for a, a 220 to uh, fit in there on a pole. And you can put it out as however far you want. And then at the end, like I've only got it out this far, so right now I'm gonna, I ran out of sticks, I'll bring more. Um, and then what you're doing is you're setting this right at the depth where the trap's gonna be you know, about three or four inches under the ice. But right down to the bottom of the, the pond. And then, like I said, as the ice, the water gets lower and the ice gets thicker, you're gonna just move the trap out farther, 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 until you don't wanna leave it set anymore. So there we got that. And this is another um, 
spot where you're gonna want to put a little dive stick right over the trap. Right there. Perfect. Just like so. Now this is going to catch muskrats too. Even get the odd beaver in here. Um, but it's a deadly otter set if it's on a system where there's otters running. Like I said, I made this set just to show you because I've got flowing water here. I will probably never catch an otter here. You know, might get a rat next time I come, whatever. But, uh, I just, you know, I told you last year I'd show you this set. It's a, you know, on an otter travel system on small creeks, this is a deadly set for right after freeze up. Um, your trap never freezes. Like I said, as the ice gets thicker, you just move it out farther into deeper water, deeper water. The one thing you do want to do though, make sure your trap is anchored well. I've got wire on the trap twisted right onto the pole, because otters are fighters. If you don't get a good catch, they'll uh, twist and, and mess around. So I'll take this here wire and attach it to one of these other poles. Or even this one right here, which is part of the dam, so I'll attach it right to this pole here. Alright, so that's the finished otter funnel set. And this is another set that you can use, you know, the ladders that I showed you last year. Um, you can just use a, a ladder on the end of it, then you don't have to keep moving the trap out. You just make the funnel and set the, the ladder at the very end and it'll last as long as you want to you know, you can have it in four feet of water then at the end if you want. And you don't have to keep moving it. Alrighty. Good luck with it.